where the shits again. Still, it is the middle of winter, down here, down under. <laughs> Like I said, we're the sh uh, here in Wellington at the moment. It's uh, star date is Sunday the 21st, 23rd. Whoa, where did those two days go? Uh, 23rd of July 2023. I went out this morning, went to see my sister, picked up a tree, a cherry tree, and I took my drone with me on the off chance that the weather might have picked up a little bit, but it didn't. Um, but I did, I did get the drone up for two minutes. The reason for this video is I wanted to show just quickly how to check how many cycles your battery's done for your DJI Mini 3 Pro. Um, so let me show you, it's not hard. Um, I got rid of the fly more bag and now I use this $17 camera bag which I got online. Um, it suits me better, um, it carries a whole lot more stuff. Uh, plus I can put my camera in here as well, so that helps. So I'm going to need my RC. So I pull that out and crank that up. I don't want to put the sticks on it. And I'm going to need my drone. So I'll undo that shortly. And I'm going to... I've done this already for batteries 1 and 2. So I'm going to do it for battery 3. Um, the idea... The idea behind all of this is to basically uh, balance the batteries. So I don't want to just keep using battery 1 all the time. So I want to... Um, spread the load if you like. Battery one has 12 cycles on it. It is winter down here. These, this is a new drone. I've only had it a month or two. Um, don't get many opportunities to get out and play with it. Uh, battery two has eight cycles on it and I'm just going to check battery three now to see how many cycles this one's got on it. Right, so I'm going to need to power up the drone uh, to do that. So first things first obviously. Uh, this is a hair tie um, just to keep the props together. I could get one of those fan dangle um, clip things that everyone likes to use, but this works fine. Uh, I'm going to take these two short props down, and I'm going to flip it around. And I'm going to take these two longer props up. I'm going to remove the gimbal protector. And then I'm going to put the battery in, label side up. And then I'm going to crank it up. And I'm just going to wait for it to connect to the RC. Doesn't take too long normally. There we go. All right, RC connected. Okay, that's re me recording the screen on here. Okay, so now I press the three dots, and then I click on the safety tab. It's already on there. Should default should default to that one. And I scroll down to the battery section, and then I click on battery info, and right there at the bottom, battery cycle count is seven. So that's 7 for battery 3, 8 for battery 2, and 12 for battery 1. So the next few times I go out, I'll be focusing on just using battery 2 and 3 um, until I catch up to battery 1. If I have to use battery 1, the opportunities require that I need to use all three batteries, then I'll do that. But um, as of late, I've only been able to get out and put up one or you know, maybe two batteries at a time. So focus now is to use battery 2 and 3 until we get up to all level, we're all uh, 12 cycles each. And then I'll just start doing one, two, three, one, two, three. So that's that. Easy peasy. Right. So then I'm going to put it all away, go inside, have a cup of tea, and a nana nap. And that's how you check the battery.